Mm, it's early. Um, it's a big day too. Today, I'm getting ready for my senior pictures. I thought I could do a little get ready with me. Yeah, I have my coffee ready. Hopefully you have your coffee. I'm just sit down. And um, as I get ready, I'm just going to like ramp my butt off. But yeah, keep watching. <laughs> Uh, for anyone who didn't know, this hair, it's actually pretty tame right now, but this is like my natural hair and I have to straighten it to make it not this. Yeah, so senior picture is very exciting. We're doing it like in this place called Hudson Gardens and it's like, like a botanical garden. It's supposed to be really pretty, so that's good. Yeah, if anyone's a senior and has taken their senior pictures, you should like comment, you know, where you got your senior pictures. Oh, actually, don't do that. <laughs> uh, I don't want like stalkers to find you. I don't know, be like, I did mine in a flower field or something. Something general. I would like to know because um, I like take photo shoots in general, so I, oh, I would like ideas. <laughs> I'm trying to post more consistent on this channel, but school is obviously getting in the way. I'm applying for colleges right now and I have to study for the ACT. I haven't taken that yet. So yeah, there's like a lot of important school things going on. It's It's been a struggle. It's been a struggle, but it's okay. I'm getting through it. I'm making videos like this one right here. I'm getting ready to be seeing your pictures. Okay, so now what I do when I straighten my hair, I like to do it in three parts. So like I have like the bottom layers and the middle layers and the top. So that's how I like section off my hair. Um, so how's life going for me? You know, senior year has been pretty good. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. I really like my classes. I'm taking AP Lit, Government, Link Crew. Like if you guys have a Link Crew club at your uh, schools, it's a Link Crew class. So I'm in the class. <laughs> In zoology, that's been quite interesting. Yeah, I've just made a lot of friends this year and I'm really happy about it. Like that's really my goal this year as a senior is to make a lot of friends and um, not really like worry about finding a boyfriend or whatever, you know, on the subject of boys. <laughs> I did get two guys Snapchats in one day, in person too. So, I mean, <laughs> I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on my uh, game, you know? Ew, why did I just say that? Oh, I've been single for so long. But that's okay. Being single is good. You don't want to look for a boyfriend. That's what I've learned. Hannah Maloche told me this. Not really me, but in a video when I watched it. She said, don't look for a boyfriend. Look for a best friend. And love will come to you. So that's what I'm doing. So hopefully, Hannah, it works. I'm counting on it to work. Okay. I've been watching a new TV show. It's called Teen Wolf. Didn't really discover it. Like, I knew about it. And I just didn't watch it for a long time. Um... I'm on season four right now, and the weird thing about their seasons is some of them kind of have like a part one and part two, which is nice, like it makes the season longer, because there's only 12 episodes in each season, but they probably have the most attractive cast I've ever seen. Like, oh, oh. My favorite character is obviously Dylan O'Brien, like everyone just loves Dylan O'Brien, but my second favorite character is Derek which people might be surprised. People might think Tyler Posey is everyone's favorite, but not my favorite because I like Derek. <laughs> Derek is very attractive. It's just like another supernatural show, but I like it a lot. I'm really into like supernatural stuff, like the Vampire Diaries, the originals. Um, let's think about some new movies I've been able to watch. Deadpool 2, I watched that yesterday that was really really funny if you guys like sarcastic funny which i literally ranted about in one of my videos i don't remember but um yeah it's so funny it's so funny especially the end i mean i don't want to give any spoilers out but in the end when he, <laughs> he receives a script packet for green lantern <laughs> and then deadpool shoots her in oh my god it's so funny. The kind of movies that I like, I love all the Marvel movies. Like, I love nonfiction, really. Because, I mean, I'm into, like, supernatural shows. So I'm into, like, supernatural movies, too. Literally anything with a vampire in it, I'll probably watch it. <laughs> I love vampire stuff. I love spooky stuff. Spoopy. I love spooky stuff. And Halloween's coming around, and I'm so excited for Halloween. It's, like, my second favorite holiday. And... 
I'm just letting everyone know that Freeform slash ABC Family is now extending their Halloween days from 13 to 31. Like 31 days of Halloween. But it really sucks because I can't watch live TV. Like I don't have cable or anything. So I can't watch ABC Family 31 days of Halloween. It really freaking sucks. But it's okay because I like to watch um, a lot of different movies for Halloween. To get like the Halloween mood. Oh, it's so exciting. Every year, I've always wanted to like decorate my room too, like with Halloween decorations, but I, I never do. <laughs> so hopefully this year I will, and maybe I'll make a video out of it. It's just hard. It's a lot more expensive than you would want it to be to just decorate your room for like a month. Let's see, let's think of like some specific Halloween movies I like. Every year, I always watch Sleepy Hollow with the young Johnny Depp in it. Mm. That's a good one. That's a good one. Just because it's like not too complicated of a storyline. It's not scary scary. It's like a historical movie and I, I love history. It's just like a perfect combination of young Johnny Depp, history, <laughs> spookiness. I like to watch Halloween Town if I can. That's... I remember watching that as a kid on 13 Days of Halloween on ABC Family. I loved that movie. Like I was so excited for this season to watch that movie. The Nightmare Before Christmas, classic, favorite, everyone's favorite. I love that movie too. It's just fun to like cuddle up in your bed by yourself in the dark and watch these like family Halloween movies. Like I like those a lot better than like the scary Halloween movies. I don't know what else. I mean, Christmas is a long time away, so I'm not gonna make you Christmas. People are gonna get mad. I'm not gonna make you Christmas. Um, this is a new angle for y'all. Never had this angle before. My room is hard because I'm working with natural light and I only have one window and there's only a certain amount of hours of the day that it works with um, my camera. So we're just gonna try this. Currently it is eight in the morning. Normally I film around 12 to three in that time zone-ish but even then sometimes the lighting still doesn't work very well but we're gonna try it <laughs> oh dance has been good a lot of new and exciting things are happening i don't really know if i'm allowed to mention them because of i'll just say it, a lot of fun and exciting things are happening um update on the lex solo i think i've mentioned this before we got his number my studio has his number so he probably will be setting a piece in my solo which is so exciting Sorry, it's a little early, that's so why I'm not crying right now. My camera is really weird. I really hope I get a new camera for uh, my birthday or Christmas or whatever. I really want the Canon G7X, like the vlogger camera. Because I've discovered you don't need like a big camera to make quality videos. Like, Hannah Maloche literally makes like n main channel videos on her G7X. And I'm like, yeah, like a two for one th kind of thing, you know? Take it vlogging and just make main channel videos. Hopefully I wanna, I wanna get one of those, honestly. And it takes good pictures, you know, better than my phone, but they're so expensive. I, like, I don't even know how much they are right now. Probably $800. Yeah, it's expensive. <laughs> uh, this summer, I went to New York. If you haven't seen my New York vlog, go check that out. Fall break. I am going to Mexico. It's gonna be super fun. We're going to Puerto Vallarta. My parents signed up for this vacation club. The cool thing about it is um, wherever you go, wherever in the world you go, you always only pay $200 for like where you're gonna be staying that trip. So for example, if I wanted to go to Italy and there was an open condo, through the company you always pay $200 for the week. And then you pay airplane tickets and food. So you don't always have to worry about like your living expense, like an expensive hotel, expensive apartment or whatever. So that's so nice. Like traveling to like, Paris would be so expensive. But if they're this company, you only have to pay $20 a week to be staying there. So, so this trip to Mexico is like a free trip for saying like, oh, thanks for joining. So yeah. And hopefully in the future, like I was really hoping to go to Italy one day with someone, I don't know. I just wanna to go to Italy. And through this, it would be so nice because it's just $200 a week. And we could stay like two weeks and it'd be $400. It might be a little expensive food-wise because I would eat a lot, but that's okay. I just hope I could travel a lot with this. But it's really my parents signed up, not me, so. And so I will be turning 17 over fall break, which really surprises people. 
because let's just remind everyone I'm a senior. I'm a senior in high school, yes. No, I did not skip a grade. Yeah, I'm just young. I'm just young. So don't ask if I skipped a grade because I a goal for this year that I have is to have like no drama. I really don't want any freaking drama. Yeah, and like I said earlier, just make a lot of friends. Just be nice to everyone and everyone will be nice to you. I mean like high school politics and like popularity is just so dumb. I don't care about it, honestly. Hopefully you guys don't pay attention to that. Hopefully you guys aren't striving to be popular because there, there's so much more you can do with this precious time of learning and striving to grow. And there's my dad. <laughs> So you know what we'll do for with this video? I will keep everything that I said so far while doing my hair. Um, I'm gonna turn the camera off though for my makeup because I just need to go a little bit faster. I'm kind of running late and I'll focus better like if I don't have a camera to talk to. And then I'll show you guys my outfits. I won't put them on. I'll just show you guys them. Hopefully this will be long enough then. I mean, okay. So I'll see you guys later. Hi guys. Um, so. It is now five hours past. I started getting ready for senior pictures. Almost 2.30. Um, and I never to show you guys my outfit. This is my makeup. This is obviously washed out because um, I've been taking pictures for two and a half hours. I'll just show you guys my outfits really quick. And I'm eating a mint right now, sorry. So the photographer, our last kind of a uh, shot that we did was in water so since you guys have already seen this top i'm not too worried but my outfit for the in water shot was um this burgundy tube top super nice yep i've explained it so many times before and then i got some new levi jeans on fry saturday so see this is wet because i was in the water but these are some kind of mom medium wash Levi jeans and they're super nice super stretchy so I got some good ones with this pairing this top is from Tilly's bottoms Levi's I wore this dress for the first shots that we did this is in like a pretty like pinstripe blue dress this is off the shoulder and it has this detailing on the bottom which is really pretty um, and this is from the store called Alter State it's super nice it's like a it reminds me of like an Easter dress, so yeah, I wore those. I wore this for the first couple shots we did, and then I wore these jeans. These are some high waisted dark wash jeans, also from Levi's. I wore this with a couple of things. I wore it with this white t-shirt, just basic t-shirt. I got this at Target. Um, they have a brand there that I really like. It's called A New Day. It's like a simple white t-shirt. It's like long and a soft so it's nice i wore the jeans with that and then i also wore jeans with this blue pinstripe shirt i have like a theme blue here really with this uh the shirt it's really starting to annoy me like it started like bunch up and like bubble up everywhere but yeah i got some really cool pictures with the shirt and i think that's it for the jeans oh and then literally my last outfit is this black tube top yep simple i talked about it before and this is new these are striped pants i really had a theme of like blue and striped <laughs> so striped pants um these are from brandy melville i got some of this stuff on it but yeah these are so soft i already have a couple of instagram pictures in these literally my favorite pants right now so yes brandy melville or john stoma john's John Gold, whatever, that's the company. And these are like a one size, so they're nice. So yeah, that's it for my kind of get ready with me. I know it's literally five hours past I started filming this. Ooh, ow. I know it's literally five hours past I started filming this video, but um, yeah, I, I literally ran out of time this morning. And quick review on my senior pictures. I am so excited. Like, I feel like I had some really, really good ones in there. My Instagram's gonna be popping. It wasn't too cold, it was like overcast, so it was like great lighting. Yeah, I'm super excited. I can't wait to see them. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, leave a like if you liked it. Comment down below, any questions, suggestions, whatever you want to leave below. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Do you remember 21st night, September? Love was changing the minds, but tonight, while chasing the clouds away, our hearts were ringing.